This is national competitor Lorenzo Orozco and you're watching RX TV on RxMuscle.com. Welcome to another episode of Muscle in the Morning, brought to you by Iron Mag Labs, the most hardcore bodybuilding supplements on the market. I'm your host, Dave Palumbo, and I'm here to bring you all the latest news in the world of bodybuilding and fitness. It's Tuesday, July 8th, 2014, and on today's show, R.D. Caldwell's Pro Card Victory, Brazilian Bikini Champ Rocks New York, Last Minute Surprise for Layla Thompson, and Andre Adams Struts Down the Catwalk. All that, and much, much more, only on Muscle in the Morning. Winning an IFBB Pro Card is a very special rite of passage on a journey of a national level athlete. But how you win that status is also noteworthy. To win your class or take runner up is quite an achievement, but to win the whole kit and caboodle, the big bang, the overall title, well that ups the euphoria by at least a hundred fold. Muscle in the Morning caught up with Team Universe men's overall bodybuilding champion Artie Caldwell Jr. who had this to say about his big win in Teaneck, New Jersey this past weekend. Quote, Winning the overall at the NPC Team Universe was a tremendous blessing for me. It feels incredible to be on the list of all the great drug-free bodybuilders to win this prestigious show. To be only the third middleweight to win the overall title since the contest's inception in 94 is awesome. I plan on representing the United States to the fullest of my ability at the IFBB World Championships this coming November. Stay tuned for a special Christian Duke interview with Artie Caldwell later this week only at rxmuscle.com. Of all the divisions, there is no doubt that bikini is our most popular, both in our world and in mainstream society. So moving up in the IFBB Pro ranks is a big deal in terms of press, marketing, and of course earning potential. Brazilian Mariana Fernandez, this past weekend's NPC Team Universe overall bikini champion, is thoroughly enjoying the spoils of her recent victory, where she earned her prized IFBB Pro card. The excited champ had this to say to Muscle in the Morning, quote, in one word, I can say it felt surreal. I began prepping the first week of February and had my first show nine weeks later on April 12th in Tribeca, the New York Metropolitan Championships. I'd like to thank my amazing husband, Raphael, for believing in me and motivating me, my two amazing friends that helped me beyond words, Angelica Texera and Caroline Costa, and I want to send a huge shout out to Team Bombshell, Shannon Day, Jennifer Strobo, and Coach Gigi Amore. This past weekend in the Windy City, women's physique pro Layla Thompson was determined to make her mark at the IFBB Chicago Pro. She trained hard, dieted like her life depended on it, and the results speak for themselves. Her first IFBB Pro victory. Now Thompson is qualified for the Women's Physique Olympia set to take place in Las Vegas in late September. Although this wasn't the easiest year for the Rising Star contest prep-wise, she was able to get her physique in optimal condition due to the expertise of her coach and her own inner will to succeed. Layla was happy to share her thoughts on this win with Muscle in the Morning. Quote, winning this show felt amazing. Chicago was my first pro show last year and I placed 12th. It was amazing being up there against such awesome athletes. And what's really cool is that I hadn't planned on doing this contest. My coach, Trey Hodge, really thought we could have a good showing and we certainly did. IFBB pro Andre Adams has the auspicious distinction of being hired as a guest poser for the upcoming NPC Rockford Muscle Classic due to take place later this year in the month of November. You may be wondering what makes this hiring such a monumental milestone. The reason is simple. Andre Adams is a men's physique pro, and we normally don't see these model category competitors getting hired to entertain the crowd. Adams hopes to change the thought process. Check out this behind the scenes video of Adams doing his thing. You gotta love the innovators of our sport. I'd like to send out a special thanks to Brian Raymond and Diana Simmons at Progress and Pride Clothing for the fantastic threads they sent out to me. To check out their entire line, log on to progressandpride.com. Also, if you're ever in the Fort Myers, Florida area, be sure to check out their fantastic open all hours, 24-7 gym, Fort Myers Fitness. 
And finally, a special congratulations is in order for Louis Uridel and Chris Nickel for the tremendously comprehensive contest coverage this past weekend at the IFBB Chicago Pro. It was their fantastic tag team coordinated efforts that not only provided the fans with incredibly insightful content of the event, it also landed them their own buddy cop sitcom on the Fox Television Network. Check out this sneak preview of the upcoming fall season of Cool Cops. The story you are about to see is true. The names have been changed to protect the innocent. And that does it for yet another edition of Muscle in the Morning, brought to you by Iron Mag Labs, the most hardcore bodybuilding supplements on the market. Check out ironmaglabs.com today. And for full quotes and Muscle in the Morning bonus features, join Muscle in the Morning's official Facebook page. I'm your host, Dave Palumbo, reminding you to always be true to your passions. And remember to follow us on Twitter and Facebook.